Ladies and gentlemen, we hit 10,000 subscribers. Hold up. <laughs> But yeah guys, we really did it. I honestly never thought this day would come, you know, back in 2015 when I started my YouTube channel. I really didn't think I'd ever even make it past 100 subscribers, but here we are at 10,000 subscribers. So first things first, thank you. Thank you for subscribing to my channel, for watching my videos, for really going through it all with me. I mean, I started my YouTube channel back in July of 2015, I believe, and really, I didn't know where it was gonna go from there. Really, when I started my YouTube channel, I had no intentions for making this a big thing. I was just like, oh, it's a fun place to post my yo-yo tricks and show off my cool yo-yo collection. So, really, I am just so grateful and thankful for you guys. So thank you very much for subscribing to my channel and making this entirely possible. I've enjoyed doing this so much throughout the years and it's really just become such an important part of my life. So I really, again, have to thank you guys for making this entire thing possible. And I really mean it when I say that you guys have really been with me through it all. You know, you've seen me grow up throughout my entire high school experience and even transition into college. You've seen me go through, you know, the, the major quarantine back in March. You've seen me just go through so much of my, you know, young adulthood that it's just so cool to be on, you know, this, at this point where we really have reached 10,000 subscribers. So again, it's just such an honor to be, you know, a YouTuber for you guys. And I'm just so happy that you guys, you know, stick around and enjoy my videos. So thank you for sticking around and, you know, all always being there for me. I really appreciate it. So you're probably wondering, what are we going to do in this video? So a little while back, I was just looking through some of my really old videos and I happened to click upon the 100 subscriber special. And in that video, what I did as I reacted to my old videos. So now we're here at 10,000 subscribers. And I think it'd be really fun if we did a little reacting to my old videos again. I think I've changed so much throughout the years and I think it's gonna be really fun to see what my past self used to look like and everything like that. And yeah, I think it'll just be a cool like blast from the past seeing myself yo-yo at such a young age and uh, you know really reflect on the past few years and at the end of the video we are going to have a very special announcement so be sure to stay to the end of the video you don't want to miss out on this some pretty cool stuff going on but without further ado I got my laptop right here let's check out some old YouTube videos all right so first things first let's start off with the classic Jonathan's yo-yo collection my first ever video that I uploaded on this YouTube channel let's see what this is all about hey guys this is Jonathan and this is my yo-yo collection <laughs> oh my gosh You've got to be kidding that that's my voice. How did this voice at one point be that? Let, let, we got to backtrack. I want to go back to the very beginning. Here we go. Hey guys, this is Jonathan and this is my yo-yo collection. Right, oh my gosh. Let's keep watching. Oh, real quick, I got to point out. Do you guys see in the upper right-hand corner? Yeah, you can tell how young I was because that's a remote control car right there. A remote control car that I had hanging out there along with my yo-yos. Um, it's cool though, because I still, you know, I see these two yo-yo cases right here, and I still have both of those yo-yo cases. Those are the only yo-yo cases that I use. And I'm just looking at some, most, some of these yo-yos right here. I think I actually still have most of them. You know, I'm seeing that shutter right there, the one drop down me, the puffin two. Yeah, we, got, we have all those still. So it's kind of cool how those yo-yos have really, you know, been in my possession for a super long time. Let's keep going. It's a good, good response yo-yo. This is just crazy. Like, my voice used to sound like that. I, I, I find it so hard to believe that my voice sounded like that. All right, so it looks like the rest of this video, I'm just showing off those yo-yos. Let's check out another one. All right, so let's do, uh, let's see, Jonathan T 2015. I like it. This is actually a pretty cool beginning. I'm glad I did that. Oh my gosh, you see how red my face is? That's because I was sweating so much. It was a hot summer day. Look, I'm so tired. This is wild. Checking the string tension. This is just a nice rail combo. That was like the first combo I ever made was that little rail combo right there. It's, it's honestly not bad for the first trick I ever made. I look so young with my glasses and everything. Oh, here comes the horizontal. Nice. And the ending. <laughs> oh my gosh. I was such a weird kid. <laughs> this is actually a cool shot here, the kind of walking shot. And then a little zoom in action there on the arm, comes right off. Not bad. Oh, <laughs> That's when I nearly hit the metal with my yo-yo, and I mean, that yo-yo is really expensive, so that wouldn't have been great. I don't even know why I included this trick in the video, because I actually messed up every single part of it. Watch from the beginning. So, so we're starting here. I messed up that. Look at this. Miss the rejection. Miss that. And then this really awkward arm thing that I do. And 
I miss that part and it hits me. <laughs> it's funny to see myself yo-yoing from so long ago. Like, it's such a weird thing to look at. All right, let's skip ahead a little bit. Where should we go? Where should we go? Let's check out the Bimetal Superstar unboxing review. So now we're gonna be skipping ahead about, looks like one year. Let's see what I was doing, you know, one year into my YouTube. Hey, what's up guys? I hope everyone's- Oh my gosh. Still, the voice is super high. It's changed a little bit, but uh, the voice is super high. What I find interesting is just like my appearance and my face. Like my hair was pretty short. My face looked just like very different, like structurally. And then also you notice I have the lavalier mic. I don't use that little like lavalier mic anymore because the quality wasn't that great. This is so funny, but uh, yeah, let's keep going. Yeah, you'll no you'll notice the main reason why I, I don't use that lavalier mic anymore is just because when I speak into it, it like peaks so hard. So it, like it gets really like tinny and really bad when I start raising my voice. And so that's why I stopped using that. This is not bad though, I have to say. So this is 2016, I'm a freshman in high school. I'm going into like the history of the yo-yo. So I was kind of getting, you know, I'm working my way up, understanding what makes a good yo-yo review, but still a lot of stuttering and things like that. But my voice just changed so much. All right, this video I definitely want to watch. My Shutter versus Horizon yo-yo comparison. This is a video that actually did really well on my channel and kind of gave me a little bit of a, like a boost like a little bit of motivation to keep going. So let's check out what this one looked like. Hey guys, so a lot of you guys have been asking me to make a It's so yellow. Why did I think it was okay to make my video so yellow? It's so Here's warm. Something. For all you guys that wanted a bimetal superstar versus shutter, I'm really sorry. I wish I could have done that video, but just more people have been asking me for Horizon versus Yeah. Gotta apologize to the viewers for not doing the video that some people wanted. <laughs> This review isn't bad actually. It's got a good amount of parts to it. One thing that I used to do, but that I don't do anymore, is opening up the yo-yo. So you notice in a lot of my previous videos, I would like open up the yo-yo to take a look inside. Really, I don't have any reason to do that. If I just want to describe the specs and include the parts in there, I can do that. But I don't know why I used to open up the yo-yo. There's really no reason for that. It's kind of a waste of time. Both of these yo-yos are signature yo-yos of different players. You can tell that they both fit the player's styles. It's a good point there, actually. I'm, uh, I'm I'm actually impressed that I even brought that up, but it is important when you're looking at a signature yo-yo and you're actually comparing them that you recognize that these are signature yo's for a certain player and it's gonna fit their style best, and so you gotta think about that when you're buying one. But I'm, I'm actually impressed that I brought that up. Well, well done, Past Jonathan, well done. All right, let's see what video we wanna check out next. I'm gonna skip ahead a little bit. Let's do this. Oh, yes, I know exactly what your video to look at. Amazon Fidget Spinner Review. I wanted to go viral for fidget spinners so bad, and yeah, I saw this is the key to my virality. I made one video, it did really poorly, and from then on out, I didn't do any more. But uh, yeah, I really wanted to do a cool fidget spinner video and hop on that trend to hopefully get some more views, and it totally backfired on me, did not work. Let's see what this video is all about. Well, it would appear I just lost internet. All right, we're back. Let's check this review out. Hey guys, so today I've got a kind of short- So you'll notice that. Okay, so this is 2017. The voice has changed quite a bit from that previous video. I think that's a one year difference or maybe even just six months. But my voice had changed quite a bit right here. That's that's really interesting. This is a, uh, this is a fidget spinner review. The only one on my channel. That's actually kind of a cool effect. That's a Casey Neistat effect right there. I was so, I mean, I still am super into Casey Neistat, but that's a straight Casey Neistat effect. He's done that before. Basically, they all do the same thing. You just hold it in the middle and spin it. And these <laughs> they all do the same thing. You just hold it in the middle and spin it. It's a very accurate way of describing what a fidget spinner does. Oh, I actually did an unboxing experience for this. Wow, okay. Oh, wow, that actually looks kind of cool when it's spinning there. Okay, so yeah, my fidget spinner video incredibly flopped. That's why I didn't do any more of those. Let's skip ahead just a little bit more more, ooh, slack trick and bind yo trick tutorial. I'm very excited to see what this trick even is because I don't know if I even remember it. What's up guys, Whoa, I look so tan in this. Oh my gosh, I spent a lot of time in the sun that summer. That was 2017, so that's going into sophomore year. Oh my gosh, I, I look so like strange there. Oh my gosh, but yeah, I look so tan. And I also, that was when I started working out more seriously. So I, you know, I have the bro tank on. And first I just want to apologize for the voice is still getting kind of lower. Like it's my, my voice was still kind of high, but it got it's getting lower. I just apologize for uploading the video one day late. I can't believe I used to do that. All right, let's see what this trick actually is. Oh, dude, this is a classic. Yeah, that's a classic trick right there. That's a really fun one too. I I used to do that all the, all the time. I also used to do that in competition. So that's kind of interesting. I completely forgot I even made that trick up. So. 
that's pretty cool. Let's keep going right ahead. Let's do the IO Iceberg Yo unboxing and review. Real quick, I want to look at the yoing that I was doing and see if there's any old tricks that I like forgot. There definitely are some that I forgot. Let's see what the let's see what the yoing looks like. Okay, so that's my old rail combo right there. Wow, I forgot about that trick. That looked nice. This is actually wild. I forgot I used to do those combos. This is two years ago, so this should be 2019. This is the SF Cadence Yo unboxing and review. Let's check this one out. Okay, so so as you can see, my voice kind of had matured and changed a little bit there. That's so interesting, but my haircut is so... Bruh. Look at the top of his head! Short. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I used to wear my hair like that. It's it's so short. It's like a buzz cut. Uh, that's super interesting. Let's see what the SF Cadence looks like. Wow, that beginning edit was actually super cinematic and cool. I, I really, really liked that. I remember I used to do those for all my reviews is I would do those kind of like cool cinematic edits. Those were awesome. Um, to finish off this kind of reaction, I want to go back to the very, very beginning and watch one more of those super old Yojo videos, the OGs, the one you can find when you scroll for a good long while. Here it is. Polishing the Horizon Yo. This is a classic. This is a classic on the channel. So. Hey guys, this is Jonathan. Here I've got my newly polished Yo Factory Horizon. Like? I've changed a lot. This is wild. This is really wild. I can't believe how much my voice has changed and the way I talk changes. Alright, so real quick I want to look at some of the yo-yo tricks I did back then because I definitely changed in that regard. I'm going to mute the music for this video just because it's definitely going to get copywritten. So let's check this out. Some of the tricks I used to do back in the day were so nasty. They're just like, there's no flow whatsoever. It was just kind of gross tricks. Quick note, to this day, Boing Boing is the hardest trick that I have ever learned. It took me about three months to actually get down for the very first time. That trick was one heck of an achievement for me, and I, I swear, it was really, really impossible. That trick is so cool. I completely forgot I used to do that. The kind of thing where you like whip it around like that and you get into the triangle and bring the yo-yo down. That is such a cool trick, and I honestly should do it more because it's, it's, so, it's so cool. I think that's all I got. I think that's all we're gonna watch for today, but wow, that was eye-opening for me because really like it's just so crazy to look back. I mean, you guys saw me and st stuck with me through such a critical time in my life, and really, it's insane to look back on all that and you know watch myself from this perspective. So yeah, again, thank you guys for sticking with me for this long and putting up with everything. I really, really appreciate it. Um, so now, on to the last part of the video. Very exciting. So I've got three yo's to give away here. Yes, I am doing a giveaway. Now, real quick, before I get any further, it's worth mentioning this giveaway is US only. Right now, the shipping rate for international packages are so high that I really cannot be doing that. So I'm really sorry to all my international viewers. I'm, I, there's really nothing I can do at this point, but this is going to be a United States only giveaway. So first things first, the first yo that I will be giving away is none other than the Yo Friends Sunbird. Very, very cool yo, perfect condition. That's the first yo we're gonna be giving away in that nice teal color. The next yo that I'll be giving away is none other than the Good Life Yo-Yo's Riptide. Still got the original box and everything like that. Super cool yo-yo, very excited to be giving that one away. And then finally, our last yo to be giving away is the Amplified Return Tops Juke. Look at that cool design there. Very neat. So, guys, I have three yo-yos here to be giving away. You're probably wondering, Jonathan, how do I win these yo-yos? And here's how you do it. So, it's just three basic steps. Step number one, you gotta be subscribed to my channel. I mean, if you're not subscribed already, hit that subscribe button. The next thing I want you guys to do is follow me on Instagram. I'm just at yoyojo underscore one. I'll put it on the screen right there and in the description down below. So you can just click on that. Follow me on Instagram. And the third thing to do is just to comment down below that you finished step one and two. And so saying that you have subscribed to me on YouTube and followed me on Instagram, that's all I need. And when the time comes, I will be picking a random winner from the comments. Now, do not comment multiple times, please. Uh, I will be filtering out duplicate comments. So just one comment works and that's how we decide 
deciding who wins. And yeah, just in general, as a thank you to you guys for sticking with me throughout all these years, I thought it'd be fun to give away a couple yo-yos and just all celebrate. And so yeah, this is it. We're at 10,000 subscribers. I'm really excited to be coming out more content in the future. This is such an important part of my life, and I love producing these videos for you guys, and I hope you guys enjoy watching them. And so if you did enjoy this video, be sure to leave a like. Also, if you guys are new here and haven't seen my videos before, as usual, hit that subscribe button, and I hope you guys all have a great day. I'll see you next time. Peace.